Um, I, I want to kind of pay tribute, <clears throat> excuse me, to my dentist um, here. I, I, I was thinking about it, and I was reflecting upon it as I prepared these remarks for what I was going to talk to you about. And, and, and I, um, my dentist, I consider to be my best friend. Now, he has lots of best friends, and he has lots of people that he associates with. And Bill Fessler, Dr. Bill Fessler in Norwalk, Connecticut, um, does an amazing job um, with me. And I met Bill when we first moved to Connecticut. We had nine kids. You know, little did he know he was in store for lots of dental work. He was, my, he was my son's football coach in Little League. Now, it just so happened that this Little League team, Bill is, um, his son was the quarterback, my son was a running back, and this Little League team had, for the previous two years, had not ever gone to the playoffs. They just weren't quite good enough, and they kind of lacked a really good running back. Well, we came in and filled the bill. Um, and my, I'm not, um, I wasn't the great athlete, but my son was, thank goodness. And so the, we came to the time where we made the big playoff game. And there was a big playoff game, and it, and it, was, it, was, it was scheduled for Sunday. Now, we're from Salt Lake City, and uh, we're Mormons, and we don't play football on Sunday. And so Bill Fessler called me up and he said, hi, I'm Daniel's coach. And he was, he was very nervous and quite concerned. And he said, um, you know, we, Daniel told us that he didn't want to play on Sunday and, you know, we're, we can't win if he doesn't play. And, you know, is there anything we can work out? You know, I'm Catholic and we go to church every day. You know, we go, I go to mass every day. And, I, you know, can't, can't you go on Saturday and Monday and... You can, you can even come to church with me if you want to. <laughs> and I said, I know this is pretty hard for you to understand, given that the only Mormon that you know that plays football at the time was Steve Young, and he plays every Sunday. Um, but uh, it's just something that we had to make a rule as a family that we didn't want to do. And he said, well, um, let me talk to the team, because um, I'm not sure we want to play without your son, without Daniel. He's our team leader. He's our best player. So he came back and he said, the team's voted that they don't want to play on Sunday if, if, if your son won't play. And then the other team said, oh, well, we can play Saturday. So they played the game on Saturday. And so through that time, Bill and I became very good friends, dear friends. And <clears throat> so, so to the point that we go on family vacations together. We, uh, well, I took him skiing to Utah. And we went to Mass in the Cathedral of the Madeline, and he went to Temple Square and heard the Tabernacle Choir. I go to his confirmations. He comes to our baptisms. And he's a man that <clears throat> I, I can't even imagine. I am so insured to his brand. I am a constant customer of Dr. Bill Fessler. There's nothing in the world that could cause me to leave and go to another dentist with my nine children and all the dental work that we have um, that we have to do and he is um, <clears throat> not and not just for me but for other people as well he is an icon in our community he coaches he coaches all the football teams and basketball teams is commissioner of the sports leagues and he has a thriving dental practice and I I if I, I can't even count the numbers of families that I have referred to his dental practice and I say, he is the best dentist ever. He's a good friend. <clears throat> the only problem with going to the dentist is he talks the whole time and you can't answer because your mouth is open. I don't know how. We've got to figure out a way around that. We need to have some kind of telepathic thing. But, um, and, and so that is my experience with, with my dentist. And um, I would do anything for him. I was at his 50th um, birthday party last, you know, a couple weeks ago. I, I do, you know, everything for my dentist because I am insured to him because he takes care of us as a family. Whenever there's a need, he is there for us. And he is that way with all of his patients, and he's a very successful, successful dentist. Um, 